is more than a five-fold increase in government allocation for Hindu temples and Indian-based non-governmental organizations this year. MIC President Dato Sri G. Palaniville presented an allocation of more than 900,000 ringgit aid for temples and NGOs at Port Dixon. Negeri Mani Latra Ulla, Ale Engalak, Yetilichetti Nupatta Yaruli Valangir Karare, Ade Nathala Arasanga Sarpatra Engalak, Nor Elodan Iruli Valangir Karare, Upper Motta Elam or Umbo Lechata Tandir. Palani Vale, who is also minister in the Prime Minister's department, said that 35 temples received a total aid of 865,000 ringgit and 70,000 ringgit was given to nine NGOs from Nagri Sambilan. Palani Vale again reminded all temples to concentrate on welfare activities, empowering poor people and education. <laughs> He added that the MIC would continue to seek more allocations from the government to be disbursed to temples and NGOs. The aid was part of the 10.9 million ringgit allocated by the government for 314 Indian temples and 143 NGOs nationwide. <laughs> classes <laughs> Another Rumbus and those who are either I very particularly Kadik Pacho with it. Another one in the Pana on the other Katan, Ali, very welcome, say to the Tanaman. The Pana to Pine. And I wonder, you do the work of Kalamaga and the day. You see, Nigel Chiochina theatre, the the Wangar the K and a Patrakori and the Chi in the Pana on the day and a Karachi on the day or in a plus point of the Purla Wangar the K.